Okay, here's just a quick uh, update on the Emotip radiant oscillator. And uh, I'm trying two things, the uh, double coil and also the uh, potentiometer on the relay. Now I have a 15 turn 1K potentiometer put in there in addition to the neo magnets. And that's my current draw right now. Battery's charging up, but the digital um, voltmeter is going wacko because of the pulsing. But anyway, um, I wanted to show you that this was the best thing right there was the potentiometer on the relay in conjunction with the neo magnets. Now let me crank this up. Look at my current draw now. That's full bore at 380 milliamps. It's just going off the scale on charge. I and mean, it's just charging like you wouldn't believe. And this is the double coil arrangement here. And uh, that is a um, CFL that's actually rated at 40 watts luminescent, but I believe it's actually a 9 watt bulb. Now what I want to try next is a much larger bulb to see if this makes any difference at all. But this is a great idea if you put a, a 1K 15 turn potentiometer on the relay right there with the neo magnets to fine tune it. You get some phenomenal lighting with the low power draw. I'll crank this back on down. There's 30, 40 milliamps and it's still flickering. I can move the neo magnet around and change the luminosity too by just playing with the neo magnets. And anyway, that's my latest experiment. The double coil does increase the brightness. Let me crank this up. That's with the two coils. There's one coil, two coils, one coil, two coils, one coil. Plus, I believe I'm getting much, much bigger on the charging going on in that battery than the back there. Because I don't have hardly anything coming off this drive battery. But look at the spikes coming into the back. It's just going crazy. Anyway, that's the latest. And like I say, two coils and then the potentiometer. This is just 1K um, put on the relay uh, across the uh, coil and the positive lead on the on the coil. Emo Teep Radiant Oscillator. Doing its thing.